Boxing Ego here. If you like this video, make sure you hit the like button and also subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon on the top of your screen to get notified when the latest new content drops. One. The WBC confirms that the winner of Jamal Charlo versus Hugo Centeno Jr. will be Gennady Golovkin's mandatory. Stay tuned. What up, Fight World? It's your boy Ego, and I'm back with some more boxing. Make sure you smash the like button. Also, subscribe to the channel for the latest and greatest in boxing. If you want to become part of the gang gang, notification gang, please hit the bell icon. Shout out to the Super Chats, channel donations, Venmo donations, and the Patreon family. We working. WBC had their weekly press conference, and the president, Mauricio Suleiman, says, Hopefully, they will review all the information, all the facts, and rule from everything that is available regarding the Canelo versus Triple G situation. He moved on to other news. He says, obviously, the fight between Triple G and Canelo is the one that the world waits and wants. Ever since the bell sounded finishing their first fight, the WBC has ordered an interim championship in order to address Jamal Charlo's position as mandatory. Charlo and Hugo Centeno have accepted the WBC ruling. If the Golovkin vs. Alvarez fight is saved for September, they will accept that as the winner has to face the mandatory of Charlo vs. Centeno, so the winner, and abide by that, and the mandatory will come into place after that. So, basically, the fight for May is canceled, Canelo, Triple G. If they end up fighting in September, the WBC will allow for that, and then after that point, the winner of Jamal Charlo and Hugo Centeno Jr. must face each other. Great news. For Golovkin at age 36, the walls are closing in in terms of the great competition that are all seeking. Charlo's been very vocal about wanting to prove his worth at middleweight, wanting to fight Canelo, wanting to fight Triple G. So there's some dangerous fights out there for Golovkin. Billy Joe Saunders looked extremely good versus David Lemieux. Charlo, we'll see what he's looking like this weekend versus Centeno. Then you have Danny Jacobs, who's proved that he's, he's proven and he's proved that he can give Triple G a tough fight. I thought he won that fight, right? Demetrius Andre says he'll take it. The mandatory for the IBF is Sergei Dervinchenko. That's a good fight. So a lot of fights. We'll see how this unfolds. But the winner of Charlo Centeno this weekend will be the mandatory, the number one mandatory and the interim champion for the winner of Canelo Triple G, whoever has that WBC strap. Let me know what you guys think. If Charlo or Centeno fight Golovkin, drop your thoughts in the comment section. Make sure you smash the like button as always. Hate, comment, and subscribe. Till next video is Ego signing up. So if you enjoyed this video and want more content like this on the channel, you can show your appreciation by going to the PayPal donate button or the YouTube support button. And you can donate any amount that you feel is equivalent to the value of this video. Much more to come. Thank you guys for your support. Boxing Ego, the future of boxing.